and really to sort of pull all these things together that we've just spoken about. Um, there's functionality called Azure Blueprints. So that's available within the Azure portal. Um, if you just do a search for Blueprints at the uh, top search bar, um, you will find them. Um, and basically a Blueprint um, gives you the ability to bundle together um, those different object types as artifacts and then deploy them all out to a, a single or multiple Azure subscriptions. So as part of it, you can create resource groups, um, assign RBAT role, role permissions, um, you can assign policies, and you can also deploy um, resources via ARM templates as well. Um, and that really gives you the ability to sort of stamp out an environment with uh, permissions and the configuration that you want all from a central managed place. Um, so it may be that, you know, within your company you would have, uh, you know, an architect or a or a uh, engineer create this blueprint which they can then hand off to a team of developers so that if they want to stand up a specific application environment, um, they can just take your blueprint and just deploy it to a new subscription and you, you can be comfortable that you've got that baseline level of configuration and security that, that you require. Um, so very useful. Um, you can version control it as well. So if you want to make a change, you would actually have to create a new version of that blueprint and then push that out so that you have a, a sort of history of what's been done to that environment. Um, also, Microsoft has started um, developing um, starter blueprints to meet certain requirements or for specific types of customers. So already in there, there's, there's a number for things like FedRAMP, uh, PCI, ISO 2701, NHS customers, and that will have some recommended um, things such as policies in there that should be implemented to meet those regulations. Um, they're mainly policy based at the moment, um, but they're being sort of expanded. But it's a, a good sort of starting point if you need to meet some of those requirements. <laughs> 